the recipe is beautiful. That's why we've done the research and created Solar D, the new technologically advanced Aussie home and made sunscreen. The Goldbuster Gold Sale is on this weekend at Golds Plus for four days only. Save up to 50% this weekend only at the Golds Plus four-day Goldbuster Sale. Ends Monday. Visit the Golds Plus showroom today at Golds Plus. No fuss. Here at Mr. Muscle Labs, we're creating Mr. Muscle Easy Gel Bathroom Cleaner. It removes 10 times more soap scum than maybe thick bleach, and it kills 99.9% .9 of germs. But don't just take our word for it, let's try it out. It powers through soap scum in the bathroom, and kills those toilet germs too. That's one powerful clean. Mr. Muscle Easy Gel Bathroom Cleaner. The biggest loser is casting for the next series featuring families. If your family's struggling with obesity and you want to turn your lives around, apply now at 10play.com.au slash the biggest loser. This program brought to you by Mr. Muscle Trano Ultra Gel. The big gel powers through the water, cleans to the clog and blasts the blockage away. It's cheaper than a plumber. Real cases, real people. Judge Judy. Jessica Tibblow claims her ex-husband's employer, Ed Spring, sold her a vehicle that turned out to be a lemon. The defendant says the car was in good condition when Jessica took possession. Now, so you sold Miss Tibwell a car. Miss Tibwell says that you sold her a lemon. This is the ex-husband. The ex-husband, you say, works for Mr. Spray. Correct. When you say works for Mr. Spray, describe the works for. Well, actually, Mr. Spray actually uh, buys cars at auctions, and then he brings them home, you know, fixes them up, you know, supposedly fixes them up, I should say, and then in turn um, sells them. Sells them. I do know that he buys more than he is supposed to without a dealer's license, um, and Kenneth Lang's husband goes to work at his house every day and works on these vehicles until they're ready to be, you know, sold. How long has your ex-husband been doing that? Um, maybe a year and a half, two years. That's his only source of employment, working for Mr. Spray. Um, as far as I know, he possibly might be doing some remodeling for um, my family right now, but I don't know. What do you mean you possibly know he might be doing some um, remodeling for your family? My, what does that mean? My stepbrother is having a house um, built and um, Timmy kind of is handy with things, and so they, I know that they have contacted him to, you know, come over and help with some of the remodeling. And does your former husband have any other source of income? No. And I also know that he pays him in cash as well. Of course, he pays him in cash. But your husband doesn't receive any sort of disability or anything else. No. So this is what he does for living. Correct. And why have you included your ex-husband in this lawsuit? Um, because of the repairs that were done to the vehicle were done by my ex-husband. And so not only was I sold a lemon, but the repairs that were made actually either were made very poorly or never made. And I paid for them, which basically, you know, I paid him to do this stuff and then it didn't get done. No, so. he's really not a part of this proceeding. Not in my judgment. So far, we'll see. Who is this gentleman? This is my mechanic. What year car did you buy from Mr. Spray? A 2001. And how many miles was on the odometer? Um, on the odometer, it had um, like 137,000. Okay, but so I, it was a lot of miles that you knew of that even could have been more. I was actually told by them that it had a rebuilt motor with only 30,000 miles. Does it matter? Whatever they tell you is, how old are you? 37. Whatever they tell you was, China, when you sell a used car that is 13 